Hi, I'm back again to share some interesting tax amendment news. You should have heard of the three new tax amendments, which are VAT Amendment Act 2022, Revenue Administration Amendment Act 2022, E-Levy Amendment 2022. Today, I'm sharing with you what the VAT Amendment Act means to you. The date of ascent was December 29, 2022, and it took effect from January 1, 2023. VAT has increased from 12.5% to 15%. While VAT exemptions on some imported goods like textbooks, newspapers, print materials have been removed, betting and other games of chance are VAT exempt. Now let me explain further. If an item costs 100 CDs, this will be the implication of the new rates on final amount to be paid. Prior to January 1st, after applying the 2.5 GET fund levy, another 2.5 national health insurance levy and 1% COVID levy. Your sum total will be 106 CDs. Levies of 6 CDs on the item that cost 100 CDs. It is on this 106 CDs that the 12.5% VAT would have been applied to get a total amount due of 190 CDs 25 pesos. The difference of 30 CDs 25 pesos being VAT. Today, 15% instead of 12.5% will be applied so instead of 30 CDs, 25 percent as VAT on 100 CDs item, VAT will now be 15 CDs, 90 pesos. This means that the total effective indirect taxes on purchases, which include GET fund, national health insurance levy, COVID levy, and VAT, has now moved from 19.25 percent to 21.90 percent. Prices of goods and services are growing further. It's time to take personal finance management a notch higher by planning and budgeting well. Remember, impulse buying is never a good idea. Plan well for every city you make. I'll be back with more.